I've had. And yes, I am depositing money into my business account because I am going to write this off. So if y'all got a business and y'all got big purchases like this, make sure you write it off so you can get your money back. Yeah. Anywho, I had an iPad and it worked perfectly fine, y'all. Um, but I just wanted to I got tired of looking at the crack that it had. I've had it had a crack for like a year. And so I reached out to somebody to try to fix it and they broke it even more like it completely stopped working so i ended up having to get a new ipad i ordered it from best buy and now i'm just on my way to go pick that up and that's what you guys are doing with me right now so i'm um, basically just uh gonna go pick up this ipad from miss colleen here she was super duper sweet y'all she was very helpful um i also that's the old ipad right here oh that's my baby i miss it anywho i love my new ipad don't get me wrong but my old ipad my old ipad we yeah we went through some stuff so this is how much i paid for something that i did not go in there for um i also got a camera while i was in there again i had already purchased the ipad online so i just went there to pick that up but i went in the camera section and i ended up getting the camera so yeah these are the purchases that i made and let's get into this ipad all right, so the iPad is um, definitely better than the old iPad. Storage-wise, it's 256 gigabytes. So I'm able to um, edit my videos in iMovie as well as keep stuff in my photos. My other um, iPad, I had to transfer stuff to my external hard drive i will have to stop editing like it wouldn't hold because i would have stuff in iMovie stuff in my photos and it's like oh yeah your storage is full so i would literally have to uh do one video at a time and i could only do certain um i can only do a certain amount uh i'm sorry the video could only be a certain amount along because again storage um so yeah this is gonna be great um i got more storage this one um it did come just like the other one came with the wall plug and the cord uh which is great because y'all know I, iphones apple doesn't give the little wall piece anymore with their apple products so i love the fact that the wall piece comes with the ipads every time so plus um so yeah i love this ipad it is a bummer that i had fonto i use fonto a lot when i um edit so i had fonto on my other um ipad and you know when you download fonto or something different you can't get that stuff back so all unfortunately all of that stuff is gone i can't get it back but it's okay it's okay but i was already in love with my first ipad it was a ipad air generation 4 um and this is a generation 5 same thing ipad air generation 5 is just 256 gigabytes um and honestly i it's it to me it's the same as the other one except for the storage guys like i didn't use my camera on the other ipad so um i just i really don't notice a camera difference if there is one uh you guys will have to definitely go look at a tech uh youtube you know channel if you want to know the specific specs but just me using it knowing that i used my other one for years and then you know i have this one uh, i love the color it's like a pink a pastel type color i guess um so i mean again it's the same as the other one nothing too different outside of the storage but I still love it. I'm still able to do everything that I did on the other one, on this one. Um, I haven't found anything that I can do on this one that I can't do on the other one. Um, I did look at some reviews, but obviously the things that were different didn't stick out too much because I'm not sitting here telling you guys, oh, wow, this is so much different than the other one, you know? So, anywho, the iPad is definitely a great investment. Um, I don't have the money to get an Apple computer. so And all I really do is edit for you guys on the iPad. And like, keep a lot of my business information on here. So I don't need a computer. Uh, this, did, this does just fine. I'm able to connect my external hard drive to it. And um, save videos until I'm able to upload them. Or until I'm ready to upload them to youtube so that's a plus as well like anything that i think that i would be able to do with the computer that i actually do 
I'm able to do on the iPad. So it's just a cheaper version of what I, you know, need. Or the computer will be a more expensive version of what I need. I don't really need that. So, and I can't tell you guys anything about the computer either. I've never had a computer because, again, the iPad has just always done just fine for me. So, anywho, um, like I told y'all before, I do use an external hard drive to uh, save all of my content on. Um, even when I'm done uploading and editing with everything, I still transfer it over there. So I always have it. Um, and this is what it's called. It's called a Seagate portal. Um, I got it from Amazon. I will link it in the description box below just in case you guys want to purchase it, but I'm pretty sure they have better versions now. Uh, don't mind this crack right here. Uh, it was, I went, when I used to travel, uh when i was a travel tech i put this in my bag and some acetone got on it and it cracked it but this is the part that i use another part that's um this is the part that connects to my ipad um y'all can see the name right there i don't want to mess it up but you can basically put all of these things in there the sd straight from the camera uh different usbs i don't really use any of that i just basically connect this cord to the external hard drive and then i use that to connect to my ipad and once I connect this to my iPad like this, it'll light up to let me know that it's connected and I'm able to go to my files and then I can click on Seagate and everything that's in Seagate or everything that's in my uh, hard drive, I'll be able to pull up on my files on my iPad. So yeah. Now, on to the camera. I was super excited because I've never had a camera before. Um, okay, let me stop lying. I did have a little camera when I was in college, but that camera took batteries. Y'all know that's not like no upgrade. Wait, what is it? Anywho, I got the Sony um, ZV1F, I think it's called. Um, they do have a Sony ZV1. But, I don't know, upon doing my research, uh, this was made after the ZV-1, and I guess it, you know, kind of fixed some things that the ZV-1, that people were complaining about, about the ZV-1. So, yeah, ZV-1F is what I have, and I am completely in love with it. Um, according to reviews, it is a vlogging camera, more a video camera than a photo camera which is perfectly fine for me. I honestly like taking photos on my phone. Um, I actually like doing videos on my phone, but like I said, y'all, it's a storage problem for me, So, which is why I've always wanted a camera. This little thing, I had no idea what it was. It was really giving, oh no, like it was really giving camera to pay, like Trump to pay, Al Sharp the need this piece to pay you know what i mean like that but apparently it's like a little piece that like covers the wind or different like like a muffler sounder or whatever a sound muffler yeah i know what i'm trying to say anywho the camera came with the c charger you know the one that got the same kind of you know connects to the ipad it came with this little battery and again the little toupee i call it a camera toupee and this is the camera. She is so sleek and sweet. Oh my gosh. Anywho, yeah, so I love it. This little screen pulls out to the side. Um, I, I did see like a camera that like had one that pulled out to the top. I think my best friend is going to purchase that one. But yeah, this is my bed right here, ZV. Y'all see it? One elf right there. So I was trying to figure out how to put this on. Um, I cut out a whole clip, y'all, because it was taking me a little minute to figure it out. But I figured it out. So like I said, this goes right over the microphone and it's supposed to be like a sound muffler. Say, for instance, you're doing a video outside, you know, it's kind of like going to muffle the wind sound or the background noise and all of that. So these are all the buttons and i'm not going to go through anything with y'all on this video because i really don't even know anything myself i literally just took it out the box so y'all get in the full reveal with me i know nothing okay 
if y'all know anything some of y'all want to tell me is this the best settings to put this on for videos or you know anything like that please leave it in the comments because again i know nothing um i did peep that the charger piece um is the c part okay um and then so i kind of thought about like hey can i wonder if i can use my ipad uh charger and connect that to the camera and straight to the ipad and like can i transfer like that i don't know i haven't tried it because you know my ipad is like c c kind of charger on both ends um because the wall plug is now the c charger for apple so i was wondering if i can like port the pictures and videos over like that i haven't tried it but if not i'm still able to use my sd card which i did not have in this video because i just like i said it's my first time having a camera so i didn't get an sd card i didn't know i needed one but as soon as i turned on the camera i realized that oh this is not gonna work because it has no storage so i had to go back and get an sd card so with that SD card, I'm able to take that SD card out and put that in the little side piece of the cord that I showed you guys earlier that, you know, you could put the SDs in, SD card in, and the USB drive and transfer that to the iPad. I can put the SD card over there like that um and then transfer it to my computer like that now um i did use this camera already because i was going to connect uh, a video to this so to show y'all how it worked and what it looked like but again it's my first time having a camera so my dumb ass deleted the footage so just so y'all know this is how i deleted it i ended up transferring everything to my ipad from, from the sd card sd card like i showed like i just told y'all and when i did that i transferred everything and i thought that everything was on my ipad while my camera was still connected to my ipad okay and then once i did that i went ahead and deleted everything off my camera because i'm like it's already on my ipad you know so once i deleted everything off my camera and i went back because I was about to um I was about to do another full set on my hands, so I needed, you know, the camera space or whatever. So I delete everything on my camera. Now I disconnect the camera. I go back and try to see the stuff that's in the folder that I just transferred and everything is gone, y'all. It's like it's there, but it's not there. Like zero gigabytes, zero, you know, like nothing was there. So I was bummed. Um Yeah, I was bummed. <laughs> I have videoed the case that I got for my iPad. Um, I videoed the screen protector that I got for my iPad. Um, I videoed a couple different things. So, quick side note. While I'm editing, playing with my camera, going through my content, I did find the footage that I'm telling you guys I lost. So, I'll include that in the video. I also got this little... Um, computer i mean not computer this little keyboard i just ended up re-videoing this re-videoing re-recording this with my phone but i did do that on the camera as well um yeah so yeah but when i did it on the camera i put it back in the box so i was like this is already perfectly you know i could just act like i just redid this but now y'all know that i'm acting so i had already opened this and recorded it with the camera anywho this little keyboard was super cute and i just could not help myself y'all um i saw it on i, I want to say tiktok but it could have been instagram while i was scrolling and it's just the sound it's just so aesthetically pleasing it's like it had the colors like i don't know i don't know i'm turning into like a white diamond white silver girl so white is right right now okay so it came with these little extra little buttons or whatever and a little pick to pick out the buttons it also has a c charger so that's a plus a c port type charger that's a plus um so i'm showing you guys everything a little volume switch the pull rod just messes with the lights on it um it is bluetooth so it connects to my phone it connects to my ipad at the same time i was loving that so if I'm working on my iPad and I just click on my phone and I start typing, it'll start typing on my phone instead of my iPad. So I like that. Um, again, it has all these different color functions. And if you click the little um, thing over here to the side, it changes the colors. So that's a plus. 
it also has these little stands in the back so you know for wrist support i still don't feel like they're high enough but again to each his own um let me show y'all what it sounds like let me just say the girls that get it get it because y'all hear that it's just like you know what i mean like like an applause you know anywho I got this from Amazon, so if y'all want to pick it up, hey, go right ahead. I will make sure I leave the link in the description box below. Um, I know y'all probably see these lights flickering. They don't flicker like this. It's really just on the camera. Let me get into the things that I told y'all. I did not um, get to post because I lost it, all right? So y'all remember what I said? I accidentally deleted my camera footage um, when I was trying to transfer it. Okay, so now that I was editing something, I go back into my camera and try to transfer stuff. And y'all, the stuff is back on there. So I went ahead and I was like, let me go ahead and download this stuff and move it over to my iPad and add it to this already edited video. So if my voice sounds a little different than before, it's because this is a different day. It's six o'clock in the morning and I'm just trying to, you know, throw this in there real quick. All right. So I got this, um, this case for my iPad. I thought this was really cute. It has a clear back and that way it can show exactly what color iPad you have. Um, and then I got white because I told y'all white is right these days. So this little piece slides right off and then it just keeps the plastic piece. And I love that because what if I don't want the cover right now? But then what if I do want the cover? I can just slide that back on and then close it right on up and boom. All right. So I did have something like this before, um, but the pencil part, the pencil holder, I don't know if y'all see that right here. It was on the other side, which didn't make sense because the charger is on this side of the iPad, the iPad charger from the side if you like put the pencil up against it so now my pencil is always charged because it's on that side duh anywho so now this is just me putting the ipad on the little um keyboard showing you guys how it works how it looks oh my gosh i love it anywho oh yeah i also forgot to tell y'all all of the rest of this footage um was shot with the sony zv1f so yeah if y'all want to see what it looks like that's this all right so this is just me testing the keyboard i also got this little wireless microphone now i did have one that had cords before um i never used it probably because it had cords i don't know i'm still not using this one now and i'm gonna tell y'all why I don't know if y'all seen my iPad, but this was about September 18th, and now it's like November 9th or something. I'm about to get ready to upload this stuff. This is a, this, I'm showing y'all how like inconsistent I am with posting, okay? So it came with all of this stuff, and as y'all can see, the insert part is for an iPhone. Well, I recently got the iPhone 15 Pro, so this will no longer be compatible with my phone, and it already wasn't compatible with my iPad because the iPad uses the C port charger. So, and here you do, you can charge um, the microphone with the C port charger, but that's about it, okay? So, the next thing I got was this little iPad stand. I thought this was super, super cute, okay? Again, white is right, so I got the white one, and um, it came in four different colors. I got all of this stuff from Timu, and the, the iPad case, the microphone, this uh, stand, all of these things came from Timu. Um, so, pretty good deal. Y'all know how Timu do, you know? So, um, I did want to show y'all exactly how this opens up, folds all the way back down, uh, how it rotates, um, you know, I just thought this was really cute, y'all, and it really, it feels really, really durable, like the acrylic, all of that, it just feels so durable, and it stays in place, like, if you sit the iPad on it, it's good enough to hold it up, like, it, you see, like, it takes a little bit for me to move it up and down, so it's not going nowhere when you put the iPad on, it swivels all the way around. Um, again, it's very compact. You can close it. You can fold it. Put it in your bag. Take it with you wherever you go because it's really small and I love that, you know. So, and it's good for your phone as well. If you want to uh, just prop up your phone and watch something while you're doing something, it's good for that too.
All right, so the last thing that I got was this little um, tripod, the auto tracking tripod that's been all over TikTok. I got this from Timu as well. I didn't get it from TikTok, um, but it's the tripod that you put your phone on and it moves with you. Um, it's apparently making content creating so much easier. Um, again, my procrastination has not let me use it yet, so I don't know exactly how this particular one works. Um, I get depressed and I go into my little spells and yeah, so that's where I've been, but I'm out of it right now and I'm trying to give you guys all of the um, content that I have, that I have been doing, but I haven't been posting, okay? So these are the directions, all of the features of the tripod and um it's really really neat so when i do use it i'll let you guys know how that goes um it comes with a charger it comes with this stand so that i can sit up and move with you it can also be um screwed on to a larger tripod um <clears throat> so the little circle stand is not your only option so if you wanted to take it with you and you have a taller um canvas you can put it on a bigger tripod um if I can, I want to be transparent with you guys. I want to, one, thank y'all so much for all of the love. You guys following me. You guys subscribing. Um, you guys commenting. I know that I asked for those things. Um, and I did realize I did not check my YouTube studio for about three weeks. And then I got on there yesterday. And I saw all of these comments. All of this love. And y'all, I almost cried. I think I did like drop a little tear because it's like all of these people believe in me. All you guys are waiting to see what I'm going to do next. And I'm just over here in a corner balled up because life is life and you know, so I don't know. I am going to try to do my best to uh, be a little bit more consistent. And I do thank you guys for all of the positive comments, all of the motivation, all of that. Like, I really appreciate y'all. And I just want to say keep doing it. And I say that because even though I might not answer because I'm going through one of my little depression spells, like, I realize that those comments help me come out of those spells. It helps me be like, girl, what what are you doing? get the fuck up stand up you know so thank y'all so much i really love y'all for that so anywho i'm done with the emotional part um everything that i put in this video i will leave uh leave in the description box below a lot of the stuff i got from amazon in the beginning uh the second no let me stop um the other the camera and stuff i got from best buy y'all already know that but the package of stuff uh that i had at the end of the video all of this came from timu so i'll be sure to leave that in the link uh, in the description box below. I won't leave it out for you guys. And I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. And again, don't forget to leave comments. Let me know if there's any settings that I could use on my camera, any settings that I could use on my iPad for content creators to make it easier, any apps that I can download. Just give me the tea, y'all, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see y'all next time.